My question is, is it in the United States realist or restraint? Is it in its realist interest to engage directly or indirectly in Africa in terms of investments or directly militarily? Or is it better off in our to just maintain the restraint that we've sort of exhibited in the past decade? I'll take a quick stab at that. It's not in our interest to compete strategically with the Chinese in Africa, just like it wasn't in our interest to compete with the Soviets in Africa during the Cold War, because Africa is not of strategic significance to the United States. There are three areas of the world that matter to the United States, East Asia, Europe, and the Persian Gulf. And those are the three areas where we should worry about the Chinese. We don't have to worry about them in Europe, I don't think at all. The two places we're worry about, if we're gonna worry about the Chinese, are East Asia and in the Gulf, and not in Africa. And it would be the height of foolishness to get deeply involved competing with the Chinese in Africa. It seems to me, sir, your question is a really, really good one, because it's, it's if you like, it's the litmus question test to this issue of realism versus restraint. If, if like John Mearsheimer, you have that hard-nosed realism that Africa does not, is not anywhere close to the significance of the maintenance of our position in Europe, the maintenance of our position in Japan, East Asia, then you would have to agree that uh, it, why not just you know, stay back in a, for a long time as Bismarck did and say, let, let the other powers do what they will in Africa and they probably find it is to their disadvantage. Exactly, they're gonna get in trouble. <laughs> right? When the Soviets went into Afghanistan in 1979, virtually everybody in the national security community was aghast. They thought this was the end of the world. My view was this is the best thing that could happen in the United States. <laughs> you want to go into Afghanistan? Be my guest. You want to go into Vietnam? Be my guest. Stay out of those places. It ends up with no good. 